This video will show you the manufacturing of multicolor LED lights. What you're currently looking at is a dice placement machine. The dice is a little cubicle inside the LED that gives the light. This process has to be done several times since these multicolor LEDs have more than one of these dice to be able to mix colors. On the display, you can see that the second dice is being placed and the little square on top is the IC that controls these dice so you can mix the colors. The next process that's needed to make this LED is called wire bonding. And that's a process where the machine draws a very, very thin wire from the IC to the dice and from the legs of the LED to the IC to supply it with power. This process is going incredibly fast, as you can see on the display. You can see the speed at which the uh, wires are drawn from the IC to the dice and from the IC to the legs of the LED. you can clearly see what is inside one of those LEDs. The IC on the left side and here are two dice on the middle and on the right side. needs quite a lot of these machines running simultaneously and as you can see here in the wire bonding room they do just that they have about 35 of these machines running 24 hours a day So after the dice have been placed and the IC has been placed and the wire bonding has been completed and for the white LEDs the phosphorus has been placed, it's time to encapsulate the LEDs. This is done by placing the uh, copper or metal strip with the dice and IC attached to it into a mold. That mold is then filled up with a resin and then the mold with the resin will go into the oven after they have been baked, the result looks like this. They come out of the mold just like this, and you have a LED that is ready for the next process, which is called binning.
after the packaging has been done, the LED will go to the binning machine. This machine sorts the LEDs depending on their color and light strength and several other factors such as forward voltage. This is a very important thing because this makes sure that you as a customer get what you ordered. Over here we can see all the drawers. We have 79 drawers and as the LEDs are being tested they are separated in each of these uh, drawers so that either every drawer contains exactly the same kind of LED with the same board voltage, the same light efficiency and also the same light characteristics which is all being recorded by the camera module that you can see uh, right now. Then this information is sent to the computer of the binning machine and here we can see the spectrum analysis, the light spectrum analysis. And you can clearly see that it's separated in four bins. So this is a pretty high quality LED since there are only four bins that it falls into and actually most of it falls into three bins. All right, that was it. And if all that job is done well, you get LEDs like this, digitally controlled, full RGB, running off of two wires, and they look great. So that was my video. I hope you liked it, and don't be shy to press the like button or contact me if you have any questions.